Hi students today we are going to learn how to draw monocot stem ts very easily okay so transverse section of monocot stem sector diagram we are going to draw okay for this first of all you have to draw two lines like this to draw the epidermis and draw cross lines in between those two okay draw lightly okay. next two more lines like this for a hypoderm hypodermis okay. draw rough lines like this okay hmm? these are vascular bundles generally monocot stem have scattered vascular bundles the peripheral vascular bundles are very small and the central vascular bundles are very large now i am drawing epidermis these are rectangular cells without any intercellular spaces generally present in single layer okay you draw like this okay this is epidermis epidermis of the monocot stem outside the epidermis i am drawing cuticle okay it is a thin layer okay there is no trichomes in the monocot stem okay below the epidermis there is a hypodermis generally monocot stem possess clear and chymaceous hypodermis okay and hypodermis is made up of clear and chyma okay in dicots hypodermis is made up of colon chyma but whereas in monocots it is made up of clear and chyma okay so to represent clear and chyma you have to draw double lined cells like this okay you have to draw one more line inside the cells to represent clear and chyma clearly okay this is hypodermis generally you have to draw two lay two lines two layers okay so below the hypodermis there is no cortex perisoical endodermis etc so total space occupied with the ground tissue it is made up of parenchyma okay now i am drawing vascular bundles this is bundle sheet cells i am drawing bundle sheet cells okay so inside uh, okay first of all let me draw all the bundle sheet cells okay this is outer layer of vascular bundles generally monocot stems have va scattered vascular bundles as i have mentioned earlier okay this type of steel is known as attacto steel attacto steel okay simply you have draw three vascular bundles to represent monocot stem like this okay okay generally it looks like a human faces okay now i am drawing metax xylem this appears like a look like a two eyes okay this is phloem phloem cells you draw like this okay below the metax xylem here you have to draw protox xylem okay this is protox xylem and this is lysogenous cavity lysogenous cavity it look like a mouth no okay now again it is phloem it is phloem okay and metax xylem metax xylem okay again protox xylem below the protox xylem you have to draw one cavity lysogenous cavity water filled cavity okay again phloem same as usual it looks like a human faces no hmm? two eyes one nose and one mouth okay This 
ഗ്രൗണ്ട് ലൈസൻസ് ഇൻ സ്കാവിറ്റി ഓക്കെ ഗുഡ് നെക്സ്റ്റ് ദി റിമൈനിങ് സ്പേസ് ഇൻ ദി ഫാസ്കുലർ ബണ്ടിൽസ് ഫില്ലഡ് വിത്ത് ദി സ്ക്ലിയർ ആൻഡ് കൈമ യു ഹാവ് ടു ഡ്രാ ലൈക്ക് ദിസ് ആഫ്റ്റർ ഡ്രോയിങ് ദി സ്ലിയർ ആൻഡ് കൈമ യു ഹാവ് ടു ഡോക്ക് ദി ജൈലം ആൻഡ് ഫ്ലോയം ടിഷ്യൂസ് ആൻഡ് ലൈസസ് ഇൻ എ സ്കാവിറ്റി യു ഹാവ് ടു മേക്ക് ഇ ഡാർക്ക് ടു എലിവേറ്റ് ദോസ് ടിഷ്യൂസ് ഓക്കെ സോ ഇറ്റ് ഈസ് ദി സ്പേസ് ഫില്ലഡ് വിത്ത് ദി സ്ലിയർ ആൻഡ് കൈമ ഓക്കെ ഗുഡ് you draw like this okay like this you have to draw draw clear and kaima okay after finishing this okay we have to draw the entire space with ground tissue okay there is no differentiation between these tissues like a uh, co- cortex endodermis etc it is total space filled with the ground tissue it is made up of parenchyma okay like this you have to draw complete and almost very easy no okay you have to dark it all the tissues like this okay this is cuticle okay this is epidermis this is hypodermis hypodermis okay this is ground tissue it is made up of parenchyma this is bundle sheath cells bundle sheath cells this is phloem this is metaxylem metaxylem protoxylem protoxylem and this is lysogenous cavity lysogenous cavity okay this is vascular bundle entire vascular bundle okay completed thank you for watching hope you like this